For your jumping jets and your tippy toe tumblers in the balance beam room for the next two weeks, we have Halloween coming up. So we have a nice Halloween themed circuit for them to complete using a bunch of our tumble track stuff. You're going to first review what no sharing feet is. And we got that from Lindsay Stansel at Excel Gymnastics. Um, but we started in our toddler program now. So we have the kids put one foot in front of the other. And you're just gonna do this on the purple line with them in the middle of the room. Just review that for a minute and then explain the circuit. For the circuit, they are going to get started over here with some ankle prehab. We're using some of our sticky manipulatives from Tumble Track. We've got the square, the triangle, and the star. So they're going to get started with the square. They're trying to do one foot hops. They can go into a passe and hop in the shape of a square. Then if they need a challenge, they're going to come up to the triangle and try the triangle. And then if they need a super challenge, they have this star. So they're gonna to try to make the shape of a star and that's really good ankle prehab for them. Then they're gonna come up here. Actually, my ankle is already burning from that. They're gonna work on squat and stand and just general balance on the pink balance beam today. So they're coming up here. They're gonna step into the hoop, squat down with their chest up, pick up the hoop and stand up. Get the hoop off of their body, put it onto the fun stick, and drop it. Step into the next one, so on and so forth, to the matching colors. Over here on this bounce beam, we have some creepy crawlers. So again, we're going to use that no sharing feet concept. So make sure one foot is right in front of the other, and they're going to bend and jump over the bugs. down the balance beam. We have been working on backward rolls with them, so we're gonna incorporate that again. This is gonna go in between their feet. They're gonna lie here, put their hands down on the floor, and pull the little bat all the way over into the backward roll this time. Previously, we had just been working on bringing the bat over and dropping him into a hula hoop, but now they're really gonna do the full backward roll. And then, Follow the arrows. To complete our circuit today, they're just gonna work on their counting skills. So we have some autumn leaves here, and we're putting one, one, two, and one, two, three in the hoops. After they do that, they do need to pick back up the leaves and put them back in the starting position so that the next person will have them available. So in our circuit today, we got some ankle prehab, we got some general balance, squat and stand, we got some jumping on the balance beam, backward rolls, and practicing with our counting.